In this video, we're going to show the uh, various components that you receive with the bridge analyzer and then walk through startup and general operation. So when you receive the analyzer, you receive several things in the package. You receive the analyzer itself in a soft case and we recommend using the analyzer in that soft case as it protects you from protects the analyzer from uh, dropping and also thermally insulates it. There's a user manual which would be a guide to operation and troubleshooting. There's also a calibration certificate for this specific analyzer that uh, describes basically that we've done testing on specific gases for this serial number. Serial number is listed right here under the uh, front panel in case that's ever necessary. And also <clears throat> you receive some septums which are used for testing. Inside the front pocket you'll see the sample line with a filter and a needle. Sample line attaches to this fitting here and it's a manual screw in there. And then the protective cover you can pull off of the needle. And then there's a 25 millimeter filter which filters out particulate and also moisture. This sample assembly can fit into a hole there. You'll receive one spare filter for later use and then also a power adapter which we've been labeling with our name on it so you know that this power adapter goes with the bridge analyzer. This <clears throat> when it's plugged in you can you can plug in the analyzer here to recharge the batteries when you have it charging, it'll light the LED right underneath the power socket. So there's a power switch right here. If you turn that on, you'll see that the analyzer will display all eights and then go to dashes. You'll also notice that the pump motor ran for several seconds and then shuts off. So this would be a normal operation. So you <clears throat> now are sitting here with all dashes. The unit is waiting to be zeroed. So we're going to zero. We push down the zero button and hold it until the pump starts and the dashes start blinking. At this point, the analyzer is drawing air into this port here and exhausting out over here. So there is no air being drawn in through that sample needle. <clears throat> the zeroing process is basically setting the reference level, level for air. <clears throat> so air is 20.9% oxygen and you'll notice that's where we start. At this point now I am drawing air in through this needle here through the sample line and just to be sure if I breathe over If I breathe over that needle, you can see I'm drawing it in. So at this point, we're ready to do some testing. But first, I'm just going to hit, it's running in a continuous mode right now. But when you're testing packages <clears throat> of product, you're going to want to do a discrete test mode, which will be a, a pump and then test and hold. So I'm going to hit the test button. When I hit the test button, it'll blink. The factory preset is 15 seconds. So it will take a test for 15 seconds and then it will shut off and you'll know it's done because the blinking will stop. So now if I have a package to test, in this case I'm going to test some uh, product here, you can apply a septum. So we have a, some septums and I can apply that to the bag like so and then I will puncture the package and press test. You can also squeeze the bag a little bit to create some positive pressure. And at this point it's doing its 15 second test and you'll notice we're down less than 1% and we're actually at 0.348% uh, 
oxygen. I can run a second test if I like. <clears throat> In some cases, these oxygen sensors take a little bit of time to uh, sensitize down to the low levels of oxygen that we see in packages like this. So there is our second test complete. At this point I can remove the needle and put it back in the manifold and I can record that oxygen level. In this case it's 0.25 percent. So at this point we've run a test. We can then take our analyzer and go do additional tests and um, that's how the analyzer essentially operates on a, on a standard basis for testing uh, packaging that has been uh, purged with, with gas uh, other than air.